Hello and welcome to a new video tutorial by Crockfix. Uh, I wanted to share some knowledge with you. Uh, we got into a service, we got today a computer uh, where we get some beeps. And uh, I wanted to show you what is going on here. Um, so that you maybe, if you have a same problem, uh, I can help you with that video. So, yeah. The power cable is uh, connected to the computer, everything is connected. When we turn on the computer, it starts, the lights go on, but you will hear some sound. So you get two beeps, two short beeps, uh, then there is a pause, and then again you get four short beeps. So, to let you know, before you go try everything out, before you uh, try to replace the GPU, the memory, uh, the power supply, the motherboard and everything, uh, we want to let you know where is the problem. So, uh, in this case, I will show you later in the picture. You always have to know uh, on your motherboard which BIOS is on the motherboard and uh, also which brand is it. Then you go look in the uh, manual or find on the internet what uh, this beeps means and then you are a bit closer to the solution. First you have to know which motherboard you have so you can check on your motherboard box or on your motherboard itself it's written under the gpu socket usually uh, in our case we have gigabyte x407 ultra gaming and we will need to download the manual so i'm downloading here the manual that's the manual and then you need to scroll down uh, to see the specification Okay, and then you will need to check the BIOS. Which BIOS is it? Okay, BIOS. You see here, it's use of license the uh, AMI UFE BIOS. So we write down AMI beep codes. Okay, let's check the first one. In our case, we have two short beep, beep codes. It means parity circuit failure, which means that your RAM uh, memory is not working correctly. And then we have also four short beep, uh, beep codes, which means system time failure. Uh, but if you don't have enough knowledge, then you can't know what is really going on here. So in our case, when we uh, replace the CPU, the computer started working. So. The CPU was defective and that's why probably it, uh, the CPU and the RAM didn't uh, communicate that uh, that's why we got two short beeps and four short beeps whatever I... uh, we tried also to reset the BIOS and it wasn't it so where is the problem the problem is on the CPU when you get two short beeps and four short beeps after then 99% is the CPU uh, we already tried to remove the CPU, we tried uh, another one and uh, yeah, the computer after one minute boots normally. Uh, always when you install a new CPU, uh, the motherboard will uh, uh, need to go through some process uh, to connect the new CPU uh, uh, to also um, uh, install it uh, to the new BIOS, connect everything and communicate correctly. So the first boot needs maybe one minute or two minutes and then after it works normally. So I hope uh, I could help you with this video. If you have the same problem or something, uh, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. And uh, yeah, thank you for watching. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, comment below and I will try to answer them or maybe the community. If you want to donate and support my channel, many thanks. The link is in the video description and in my bio. Please don't forget to subscribe for more videos. Thank you.